Hi guys, Topman Jim Bobby again, doing um, another video. This video will be gold pack opening. Uh, today, earlier on, I placed £25 on PlayStation. Bought FIFA points, I have 28 FIFA points, uh, sorry, 2,800 FIFA points, which equals 28 packs worth 100 FIFA points. I'll be doing it in two parts, just mainly on a trial and error basis, just in case one or the other video doesn't work, at least then I have one to put up. Um, I will be doing the odd occasional pack opening video other than these, so if you like this and this is what you want to be seeing then please subscribe and I'll be doing more shortly. Right guys, so here goes. You will see in the top left hand corner where it says FIFA points I have 2,800 or the equivalent if you hope opening packs worth 100 FIFA points, that's 28 packs. What I will now do is go into gold packs and I have a superstition so I'll only open the packs worth 100 if they have Lionel Messi, El Sharawi, I think it's Mayo Yoshida from Southampton or even Falcao, any of the others I won't open. Don't know why, it's just a superstition I have. So I'll start off with opening the first pack. You can see that first pack I think is Yoshida from Southampton. Doesn't matter who it is, it's a Southampton player, but I will open this and see who I get in it. Fingers crossed it'll be someone decent, but if not, I'll show you then what I do with them. I'll select yes on that to open the pack. Just wait for it to open. Some people just double click X here and take you straight to what you get, but I like to just let it spin out and then see what I get. You can see there that I got a rare player, who's Solomon Rondon, who plays for Ruben Kazan. Uh, he wouldn't fit into any of my squads that I have, or on this account, a squad that I have. It's primarily German. So, what I will do is send all to club by pressing L1 and select yes on that. Um, as you will see, a duplicate has come up of a football, which I don't, don't really keep anyway, but nevertheless, it's a duplicate. What I will then do with that... And same with anything else really, other than players. If it's a player, I'll just press triangle and send to transfer list and sell him later on. Um, I will be posting a transfer video later on on what players go for and what they're worth. So that'll be a tutorial probably later on tonight, if not tomorrow morning. What I will do with this bar now is just quick sell. It's probably only worth three coins, I think, but I'll press R1 to quick sell. And I'm actually wrong, it's worth 15 coins. So... 15 coins, it'll add to me tally, that'll go up from 10,070 odd coins to 10,086, so I'm not much different, there's the first one. Right, so the second pack I will now open, and again, like I've explained earlier on, I only open it on various 100 packs, providing they've got the player I like to open on. So El Sharawi, he is yet another player I like to open on. As you can see, it took 100 points off me in the top left-hand corner for the previous pack I opened. So here goes with Al Sharawi. Fingers crossed again that something decent's in it, but if not, we'll just send to the transfer pile yet again. I'll double-click this just to show you that you can um, do it quicker than what I've been doing it. Uh, I prefer to let it just roll out, as I've said earlier. But there we go. No one really decent. There's a rare silver, but... Not really worth too much, I wouldn't have thought, on the transfer market. But nevertheless, I will be selling him later on. As for all these, there's no duplicates. So again, I will be sending them all to club. And I will deal with them once I've opened the 28 packs I have to open. I will now go back to the gold pack store. And again, I'll search until I find a player I like. And again, it's El Sharawi. So I will open another pack on El Sharawi. And here goes. Hopefully, I mean, you should be expecting to get one decent player who's worth something. If you're not going to keep him, then you'll be able to make something selling him. Um, unfortunately, not in this pack, but for me that doesn't really matter. I have a decent squad anyway. As you can see, there's modifiers, fitnesses. They are going to your consumables. It's up to you if you want to sell them or keep them. But for me, I keep them because somewhere down the line they will come in under. But don't get me wrong, they're worth quite a bit. I can get you the odd few hundred coins on the transfer market. So now I will send our items to my club and deal again with them later.
again, I will just keep searching until I find a player that I feel confident of opening on and like opening on. As you will see, there's Vidal there. I won't be opening him because I'd, I've never really experienced getting a decent player in packs with Vidal. Like I say, it's purely superstitious, but that's just me. I know people who have got decent players, and there's quite a lot of people who just open any pack. So again, we'll be opening El Sharawi, and maybe third time lucky on getting a decent player. But if not, that doesn't matter. There's still another 24 packs to go after this. Right, well there we go, it's a rare gold player in Morgan de Sanctis, a Roma goalkeeper. Probably so far between 700 and 1200 coins I should imagine. So there's a few decent coins in that there. Kristen Trash now would fit into my German team but I already have three right backs and off the top of my head I wouldn't say he's any better than Philip Lahm and co. So he again will go straight to club and be sold in a transfer auction later on. Okay guys, so there's another 10 packs yet to open in this first part of the opening packs video that I'm going to be doing. Like I explained earlier, it's purely on a trial and error basis. Um, just a one-off really. Next time I do it, it'll be all packs opened. So here goes with Yoshida from Southampton. I generally get all my best players in the Southampton pack. Like I say, superstitious, but I, I generally get all my best players in this pack. So fingers crossed here if I get something decent. <laughs> and as luck could have it, it's not really, but I do get a rare contract. So, I mean, that'll enhance your player's contracts, no doubt. And I get 2,000 coins, which also enhances how much money I have, or should I say coins. Um, what I will do there is just select the coins, and then click X on Redeem Item. That will add 2,000 coins to my funds, which is now up to just over uh, 12,000 coins. The rest, well, I will put all of them back into my club. But first of all, what I'll tell you about is these chemistry styles. There's certain ones that sell for quite a bit. Shield, off the top of my head, will make about 200 to 350 in transfer auction. The ones you want to look out for are Catalyst, Shadow, and mainly Hunter. Hunter sells for... Again, around between seven and twelve thousand pounds, depending on how many people want it and how many bidders you have. So I will now send all of them to club and move on with the next pack. El Sharawi. So this is fourth or fifth time I've had El Sharawi. So after this pack, if there's nothing decent, I might just go for a Leo Messi. Or even a Falcao who's not appeared in the 100 packs yet. Just to see, mix it up really and see if I can get anyone decent. I get the Napoli striker, who's a rare gold, in Goran Pandev. Now, obviously he won't go into my German team, but he will fetch between 700 and 1,000. Off the top of me, adding transfer. So again, that's adding to my funds all the time, which isn't a problem. So I will send all of them to club and again place them on transfer list later on. Yoshida. Now I'll do him because like I've already explained he's the one I feel most confident of getting someone good from the 100 gold packs from him. Not this time but Again, it's a rare contract again, which obviously will contract your players for a higher period of time. I'll send all them to club, I'll move on quickly because there was nothing decent really to explain about that pack. Again, I'll skip Al Sharawi this time because I've had quite a few packs with him. So I'll see if I can get Lionel Messi or Falcao. Um, I know my personally my brother prefers to get Falcao, he says that he gets quite a lot of luck opening Falcao um, packs, um, for instance Schweinsteiger is probably the best player he's had, I don't know why I've clicked off that but I'll go straight back into it and hopefully, there we go, Falcao straight away so how's your luck, let's see what I get in Falcao, uh, fingers crossed with someone decent but the way my luck's going, 
Probably not, but again, I'll make money in transfer auction. And it's one of the best free kick takers on the game in Juan Arango, who plays for Borussia Mönchengladbach. Um, his penalties and free kick accuracy are quite high. They're in the 90s. So he's someone I really want to keep hold of. Another German, just a bit of advice if you were to get him, is Nejad, uh, Zedjad Salihovic. He's got 99 free kick accuracy and 99 penalty accuracy. So if you get him, I would strongly advise you keep hold of him unless it ruins your team chemistry. Send all items to club and you'll see, again, I have a duplicate. Now, I was showing you earlier on what to do with a football. A kit is worth slightly more, but again, it, it wouldn't sell in auction because no disrespect to West Brom, it is only a West Brom kit. So, I will quick sell that and make 32 coins off that. So, it's just over double what you would get for a football. So, that one's quick sold and I'll move on to opening the next pack. Again, I'll try and get Falcao or Messi, and there we go, quite quick really, Falcao. Open this pack and see what I get. Um, hopefully it's someone decent, but again, if it's not, it's all funds towards buying players on the transfer market. Ruben Castro. Now, he's not a rare goal, but something I will be explaining later on my transfer tutorial video is that Ruben Castro, probably only worth about five to 600 coins max, you would think. But I'll explain later on video why I reckon you could get around about 1,000 coins for him. I will discard that. And quick sell. I'll try and get a Lionel Messi before this first video is ended, just to see how my luck is on the Lionel Messi packs. Now, he's not appeared on the 100 packs, which would suggest to me that there may be something decent to lie inside one. But the only way to find out is by getting him, and there we are, Lionel Messi. So, wish me luck guys, and hope I get something decent in this one. Uh, just let it spin out and then show me what I have. And, well, as luck would have it, it's probably the highest rated rare gold, I think, as yet, in Hugo Campagnaro, the Italian, uh, Argentinian Inter Milan centre-back. So I'll sell for 650 to 1000 I should imagine, on transfer market. It's not a player I need. Um there's a couple of duplicates. Now, the same with stadiums. Some stadiums do sell quite dear. Unfortunately, I don't think the Stade Gironde will sell that dear. And the football, I don't need. I don't really collect them. So, quick sell for 49 coins. Now, we'll just go back to opening any random packs again. So, I'll try Falcao. Now, what I will do is something I don't normally do. Like I said, I'm very superstitious and only open a few certain packs. I'll open someone I never normally open. So I'll just discard with all of these. There's nothing decent there, as you can see when I'm flicking through. Nothing decent. Just send all of them, sorry, to club, not discard. Send them all to club, deal with them later. See, now I would normally open Messi, but Tim Cahill, there we go. One I never, ever open. Let's see what happens here. Probably prove myself wrong here, guys, and give you all a good laugh, but we'll see what happens. Opening Tim Cahill. And, well, I'm kind of glad in a way and relieved that it wasn't someone such as Hazard or someone like that because I'd have shot myself in the foot, really. It's no one decent, but that's not to say you can't get decent players in the backs. I just don't believe you ever will. So to send all them to clubs, and I'll get back to the packs I prefer to open. Now there's two left on this this video. I will be posting a second part very shortly. So I'll open two more and then start with the second video in about 20 minutes time and upload it in an hour or so. Lionel Messi, open for 100 points. Now see what we get in this pack. And it's 
Not a bad player in Thiago Mata, who plays for the French outfit PSG. But again, I'll send all of them to club, and I do already have the Augsburg away kit. Um, I'll just discard with that quick sell. I make myself 30 coins quite easy. Again, that adds to my funds. And finally, last but by no means least for this fir first part of the video, I'm not going to open Tim Cahill again. He didn't bring me too much luck in the last one. I'm just going to open Arturo Vidal and see what happens here. I'll go on a whim here because, like I say, I've explained over and over again. I don't usually open this kind of pack. So I'll see you again getting this and then complete the video, upload it to YouTube. And the goalkeeper is, if you click R3, it will tell you who it is. I mean, I knew it was Landrau anyway, just couldn't think of his name. Uh, but Mikhail Rondrau, um, and he's a French goalkeeper, plays for Bastia in the French second division, I believe. Uh, but there's all the information you need to know on him by clicking R3. You go back with circle and send R to club. Right, so that's me for now, guys. I have 14 more packs to open later on. As I say, I will be uploading a second part. Mainly because of the trial and error basis, but it'll be only a one-off. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you've learned a few things. And yeah, I'll see you later. It's that man Jim Bobby. If you like this video, then subscribe. There'll be plenty more to see from me later on today and tomorrow. So thank you.